Good morning, and Christ is in our midst. Today is March 18th, 2020, and this marks the fifth anniversary of the repose of Father Thomas Hopko, one of the most inspired preachers, priests, teachers uh, of our time. Uh, I was privileged to be his student uh, and to also learn so much from him as a priest, as a mentor, as a friend, you can find his podcasts and his writings online in many different ways, um, on Ancient Faith Radio especially. Um, it may interest you to know that when he was a young seminary student at St. Vladimir Seminary in the early 1960s, uh, he was right here at Holy Ghost Church where he gave his very first sermon uh, in his, uh, his long, fruitful life as a, as a, a pastor and, and teacher in the church. Um, on this fifth anniversary, uh, we'll say a, a short memorial service for the repose of Father Thomas. Blessed is our God, always now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. With the souls of the righteous departed, give rest to the soul of thy servant, O Savior. Preserving him in the blessed life which is with thee, who lovest mankind. In the place of thy rest, O Lord, where all thy saints repose. Give rest also to the soul of thy servant, for thou only lovest mankind. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Thou art God who descended into hell, and loosed the bonds of the captives. Thyself give rest also to the soul of thy servant. Now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. O virgin alone, pure and blameless, who didst bear God without sea, intercede that the soul of thy servant may be saved. Have mercy on us, O God, according to thy great mercy. We beseech thee, hearken and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again we pray for the repose of the soul of the servant of God, Archpriest Thomas, departed this life, and that he may be pardoned all his sins, both voluntary and involuntary. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. That the Lord God will establish his soul where the just repose. The Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. The mercies of God, the kingdom of heaven, and the remission of his sins, let us entreat of Christ our King immortal, and our God, grant it, O Lord. Let us pray to the Lord, Lord have mercy. O God of spirits and of all flesh, who has trampled down death and overthrown the devil, and given life unto thy world, do thou the same, Lord, give rest to the soul of thy departed servant, Archpriest Thomas, in a place of brightness, a place of refreshment, a place of repose, where all sickness, sorrow, and sighing have fled away. Pardon every transgression which he has committed, whether by word or deed or thought, for thou art a good God and lovest mankind, because there is no man who lives and does not sin, for thou only art without sin, and thy righteousness is to all eternity, and thy word is true. Thou art the resurrection and the life and the repose of thy servant, Archpriest Thomas, who has fallen asleep, O Christ our God, and unto thee we ascribe glory together with thy fathers from everlasting, and thine all holy, good, and life-creating spirit, now endeavor unto ages of ages. Amen. Wisdom, most holy Theotokos, save us. More honorable than the cherubim and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim. Thou without defilement gave birth to God the Word. True birth giver of God, we magnify thee. Glory to thee, O Christ, our God and our sure hope. Glory to thee. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Father bless. May he who rose from the dead, Christ our true God, for the prayers of his all pure mother, of the holy, glorious, and all laudable apostles, of our holy and God bearing fathers, and of all the saints, establish the soul of his servant, Archpriest Thomas, who 
has been taken from us in the mansions of the righteous. Give him rest in Abraham's bosom and number him among the just, and have mercy on us for as much as he is good and loves mankind. Amen. Grant rest eternal in blessed repose, O Lord, to the soul of thy servant, Archpriest Thomas, departed this life, and make his memory to be eternal. Thomas Upcock.